The Black Magic Cocktail is super special because it's super sparkly. We love sparkles. I think you just call me the Sparkle Witch. Hey everybody, happy Halloween. You are here drinking with Susan. I'm Witchy Susan. Today we are going to be looking at making a very special potion called the Black Magic Cocktail. Um, sorry, I just flew in and I had my broom with me. I don't need that anymore so I can go ahead and get rid of that. I'll throw it on the floor. The Black Magic Cocktail is super special because it's super sparkly. We love sparkles. It starts with two and a half ounces of black vodka. I made my own. Um, the black vodka that is available for sale is called La Vlad. The only place I could get it near me was an hour's drive away, so I kind of nixed that. So what I did was I just took all the food coloring that I had in the house and mixed it here. It has a little bit of a greenish tinge, but I think I like that better um, than the pure black. So anyways, we're going to take two and a half ounces of black vodka. We're going to pour it into our shaker cup. We're going to add to that three quarters of an ounce of lime juice. That'll give it another nice green tinge, potiony color. I love that potiony color. And then also three quarters of an ounce of simple syrup. We're going to go ahead and add our ice. We're going to add it up to the level of the liquid in there. I don't know if you all noticed, but I am using a new shaker cup. I specially ordered it, had to wait a few months for it to be made. It comes from a company called Elevated Craft. We'll go ahead and put a link down here in case you're interested. What's cool about it is first of all, it's insulated. I was getting like hypothermia, frostbite when I was shaking the shaker cup, the regular shaker cup, it got so cold. This one does not freeze my hands off. It also comes with its own measuring cup, and you will see me use this in future videos, which is really cool. It has an ounce, half ounce. It also uses um, the milliliters. And then on this end, it has its own built-in strainer, so I don't have to worry about it if I don't have my strainer with me. So we've added our ingredients. I'm gonna go ahead and close this up. And then in the bottom of our glass, I am gonna add what is called um, edible powder. This one is a silver edible powder. It's made by Wilton. We'll go ahead and put a link to that below in the video if you want to order some of this. So I can drink it and I'm not going to die. Although this, this potion I am making, rumor has it, it makes witches melt. I'm going to take my chances. I really don't believe, I saw it on social media, not sure if I believe social media, so we're going to take our chances. This sounds too good not to try. Okay, so we've got our special dust in our glass. We've got all our ingredients in our shaker cup. Listen to how quiet this shaker cup is. I love that too. My poor dogs don't get as scared when I shake a cocktail. I'm gonna take this off and we have our strainer. We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna strain it into the glass with this Special pixie dust. The powder dust, we're gonna add a little bit more on the top for our potion. Can't have too much sparkle as far as I'm concerned. You can just call me the sparkle witch. Susan the sparkle witch. I don't know about Glenda, I'm not Glenda, that's for sure. We're gonna mix it up. All right, and I really don't think I'm gonna melt, so we're gonna give it a try. Oh, is that pretty? I hope you can see it, it's nice and sparkly. Here we go. That's pretty good. I, I really. <coughs> oh, oh no, I'm melting. Oh, I'm melting. Ha, gotcha. I gave you a treat and I gave you a trick. I'm fine. This is awesome. I really like it, everybody. Except for the cat hair floating on the top. That's disgusting. <laughs> we have cats. What can I say? Um, but otherwise, it is a great, great drink. Black vodka, you can make your own or you can buy it. Lime juice, simple syrup, shake it up, throw it in a cup, and sparkle itis. You can't beat it. Very good. Hey, if you like what you see, 
I'd really appreciate it if you'd click that like button and feel free to subscribe to us at the link below. Just go ahead and click on that. And remember, if it ain't bats, it's rats. So kick back, relax, fix yourself a drink, have a happy, happy Halloween. I think we all deserve that. And I will see you next time. Thank you.